couple of toggle switches inside to turn the blower on and off. That's working, but I don't know about this. Again, it's unplugged and there's no belt on it. Power steering, air brakes, no rust in the cab, a very nice steel grain bed with rollover tarp, steel floor. The truck's frame is very clean. Not rusty, very nice. The truck has got a Peterbilt air ride suspension under it, 22.5 tires on bud wheels. See the Peterbilt emblem stamp right there. Good looking airbags. Again, a very nice steel bed with rollover tarp. We'll take a peek at the inside. Very clean, no, not a dent in sight. Get all your bows. Rubber mounted lighting, the whole deal. Tires are going to average about 25-30% overall. See that one's got some chunking out of it. Again, all on bud wheels. See how clean the bed is. No rust in the cab on this truck either, guys. Enough room for the toolbox or something there. She is air brakes, diesel, dual saddle tank. Catch the engine on this side. Absolutely running as nice as you can expect right there. We'll take a peek at the inside, let you see what's going on in there. Again, you can look at the floorboard in this truck. Original paint, glossy and clean. Don't see them like this very often. Very, very clean. The truck has got a 44,500 pound uh, gross vehicle weight rating, front end at 10.5, rear end at 34,000. truck's got a fuller Road Ranger 10 speed tr transmission in it. Got differential lock. Again, air brakes. Here's the toggle switches I was talking about. Uh, let's see. That turns the vents on, fan on. I'm assuming this is the one that activated the compressor, but again, it is unplugged and there is no belt on it. You buy it that way, guys. Uh, pack is not working. Not sure about the fuel gauge. It's registering, but I have no way if it's working or not. Showing 188,000 miles on the odometer. Again, guys, no way to know if that's a million, 188,000, or if that's original miles. Uh, it could be original, as clean as the old truck is. Could be. No way to know for sure. Showing uh, right at 50 pounds of oil pressure at an idle. Uh, temp gauge appears to be working. Obviously the air gauge is working, built, built up 120 pounds of air, no problem. The battery gauge, the voltmeter, does not appear to be working. It's not registering at all. Got some silicone around the side window here. A couple splits in the dash, as you see on these older trucks. But overall, guys, a really, really clean older truck right here with a really nice steel bed on it. Starts at $100, sells to the highest bidder.